Julian here, <clears throat> excuse me, and I am here to tell you how to change that little logo at the top of your pages when it comes to your pages in ClickFunnels, it's actually called the Favicon. So what is really quick and easy and simple, so what you need to do is go into your ClickFunnels account, log in, click under your um, funnels and it will come to this page which I was already on anyway and then you would select the actual part of your funnel so what you need to do if I was to click on to my five steps to freedom your ultimate online coaching course it's like a mini course I've just re um, created actually and uh, what you would need to do from here is if I just show you what it will look like without the logo without your company logo if you click on to edit page and then click onwards to the preview button you would then see here, it's actually got the ClickFunnels logo and I would like to change that to my logo just to make it look a bit more professional. So what you would need to do is, if I was to go back to that original page, click off here, um, I didn't make any changes so that's fine. So go back to that funnels area, uh, click on the desired page that you want to change that, uh, that icon. Uh, you go to settings, and then you would go down to this section here, Favicon URL. So what you would need to do is actually upload um, into ClickFunnels your logo under Project Assets, I believe it is. So what I do, I can show you how to do that if you haven't done that. But if you have, uh, what you can do is obviously click on the one that you would want there's a url and then you would go down here and press save and update settings now it might take a while sometimes it can take up up to 24 hours i've i've found in my experience but that should then change it we can always double check the page i'm not too sure if it will actually show up yet let's just have a look so edit page and then we will go to preview not quite changed yet that's a shame really because obviously I'm trying to show you how it works but it hasn't changed yet but if you were to go back on at a later date it should actually update for you so if we come out of that I haven't made any changes there I'll then show you how to upload an, an asset so what you would do is go to um, this part here go to settings account settings and you would go here to here we are digital assets that's what it is digital assets click onto there and you would add a new asset so you would actually upload from your computer your desired logo that you would wish to use for the top parts here um, and then you would choose a file from your desktop and then obviously give it a name and then it will actually produce for you a URL. So I've obviously uploaded already and these two links were what you saw in the previous drop down menu and then you just select the one that you wish to use and then you would paste it going into the settings of that preferred page. So let's just go back actually, let's see if it's actually updated. So go back to funnels. Click on my five steps to freedom mini course. And let's just see if it's updated. I hope it has for the purpose of this video. Preview. Ah, still hasn't uploaded, but it should actually upload. If you've got any questions or you find it difficult, and it's not uploading within sort of the next 24 hours and please let me know but in my experiences and cases it always has done so all right then guys um yeah i've actually just uh, this is now while we're here this is me and you uh, looking into the um membership site that i've just built if you're an online coach and you're struggling to get results or if you're wanting to become an online coach or you're an offline business owner and you are wanting to add an additional service to your already existing offline business then this is actually a free mini course a step-by-step -step guide like the ultimate guide and how to build an online coaching business um, it will give you everything, everything that I really needed to know when I first started and I've condensed it into five steps and 
it will give you a really good idea as to like if this is actually a thing for you to do because it is very time intensive at the beginning it, it does require a lot of your patience and commitment but I just think that if you actually understand everything in the course and it's still what you want to do I'm actually in the beta version of this service I'm actually looking for beta testers but I am here dedicating my time to you to build your online coaching business so if that's where you're at then click on the um, link below for the five steps to freedom as an online coach and if you like what you see we can then um, have a onward conversation but that's about that program that we're in now so um, yeah all right then guys i will speak to you soon bye